It is a very busy night for police and detectives here in the Bronx. We're learning that one person has now died and two others are currently recovering this evening in the hospital after a serious shooting. It appears from what we're gathering that these victims were standing outside this corner grocery store you see right behind me here when somebody came up to them and opened fire. The very latest information we have from police is that officers are still searching for this gunman. You can see evidence and markers all over the ground, sidewalk and street, little bits of clues that potentially Eventually will help officers crack this case. The investigation itself is still in its early stages, but this is what we can piece together so far. We know this gunman fired multiple shots because we can see a number of bullet shell casings littered across the ground. The NYPD tells us that the shooting happened at approximately 7:42 in the evening this Saturday. The shots rang out in this Tremont community on Clay Avenue, right where it crosses over the 95 Cross Bronx Expressway. A number of witnesses described this as a drive-by shooting. They claimed that the gunman drove up in what they believe was a black Mercedes Benz and opened fire on a group of men who were just standing outside that corner store. Now, what the motive was for this shooting, why that gunman opened fire, and who that gunman might be, well, that's currently unknown. Detectives are trying to get to the bottom of that right now. That is what they are working towards. In the meantime, the names of the victims have not been released yet. We did speak to a few people off camera. They say that, unfortunately, this kind of violence is prevalent in this community. It's not something they're happy with. They want to have changes. But all those people we talked to told us they did not want to go on camera and show their faces, not with a killer, an armed killer, still on the loose. In the Tremont community of the Bronx, I'm Steve Kouj, PIX11 News.